Good morning, everybody. Welcome to week five of our COM 235 class. I hope things are going well for you so far. Uh, over the first four weeks, we've taken a look at um, how to format uh, spreadsheets in Microsoft Excel, how to change the numbers to look like dollars or percents or decimals or whatever that might be. We've changed the fonts and font colors. So we've taken a good look at uh, formatting in Excel. We've looked at simple formulas like add and subtract, multiply, divide. We've uh, looked at what they call complex formulas, which really is just um, having more than one math function uh, going on at the same time. Something like averaging, where you have to add everything up and divide, uh, min mode, max, things like that. So not necessarily um, complicated, uh, but just, just extra steps, if you will. We've taken a look at uh, charting, and we've looked at the different charts, like line charts. We've looked at pie charts, bar charts, column charts, things like that. We've shown you how to put pictures inside the columns and things like that. Uh, and this week, we're going to start looking into um, using tables in Excel. Now, tables are relatively simple to do. Um, some folks like them, some folks don't. Some folks use them all the time, some don't. Uh, they do a couple of things for us. They uh, make our data look better. Uh, they help us organize our data. Um, if it's a spreadsheet that you're probably going to print out and give to somebody, tables are a much, much better way of, um, of uh, inputting the, day the data and uh, uh, giving it a good look when you have to print it and hand it out. Really simple to do and uh, we'll spend most of our uh, week playing around with the different looks of a table, the benefits of a table, and how to use them and that sort of thing. Uh, we're hit, approaching the halfway mark since this is week five of our class. You should have your midterm exam, I think, if I remember right. And so now's a great time to be taking a look at the grade book, look at the things that uh, you may not have gotten done, uh, things that you're running behind on, and uh, start getting those caught up because it always feels like once you pass the halfway point that time speeds up people start panicking when they're behind can't get everything done before the um, before the end of the term that sort of thing so now's a great time to check the grade book get everything turned in get yourself called up see where you stand in terms of your grades and uh, be ready to finish up the course if you have any questions or needs please reach out and uh, let me know uh, text text, and email are obviously the best ways to get me, uh, but I'm available to you if you need me. That's it. I'll see you in class.